Well, good day. Glav here. Welcome back, and thanks for checking back into Glav's World. If you haven't already subscribed for Christ's sake, go and do so. And if you like the videos, hit the like button on YouTube as well. This ride with Dark Side Riders is to Kanchanaburi, one of our favourite spots. Normally, uh, well, not normally, is the home of the Death Railway, etc. But I've done videos on that before, so I won't repeat myself. From Dark Side Riders, this time all on Harley's are myself. Palmy and Olivia and we've got a mate Matt joining us on our Triumph Rocket as well. Day one sees us head north 430 k's to Kanchanaburi but up over the top via Suffenberry. We avoid Bangkok at all costs. Why Suffenberry? Well it's a good town, it's a good ride up there but it's also the home of CFM which is a large Harley parts and aftermarket distributor. Boys and their toys couldn't help but spend money, watch what happens. Day two we head north out of Kanchanaburi and do the mountains and do the lakes. That's a very technical ride. It is a great ride to do. Day three we head home again via Suffenberry of course. Once again boys and their toys see what happens. All up this ride was about 1150 k's. Great ride, great mates. Hope you enjoy it like we did. Happy days. The lads and I are just heading out of town through Pong, out Pong High Street. Just picked up Palmy and Matt. Olivia has got a meeting this morning, so he's going to ride through Bangkok later today and meet us tonight at the hotel. Kanchanaburi, here we come. Let's hope the rain stays away. to the 331. Up the 331 we go. We're on the 3076. Up in Nakon, Nayok. Not a bad bit of road this one. The surface is a whole lot better since I've been along here last time. Straight but pleasant. CFM Mosky Performance at Suffenberry. Just thought these are a big aftermarket supplier and also um, used parts supplier here in Thailand of Harley parts. So we thought, what the hell, we're going through, let's just call in. So what are the chances of this? Call into a place in the middle of nowhere and I just happened to ask them do they have a Bazzini 36 inch prone set of fish tails and the girls inside say typically tight no ham and then a guy approaches us later and asks if we can help anything I said you wouldn't happen to have a 36 inch chrome fishtail to fit my heritage yes we have one so I've done a deal so here we are halfway up Thailand and there's my bike on the rack getting a new exhaust fitting what are the chances of that the exact exhaust I wanted to there is a god We are on route 3260 now, heading 
next time we stop we'll be in Kanchanaburi. Uh, just had the Bazzini exhaust fishtails fitted. Uh, a little bit unsure. They're definitely quieter than the tab exhaust. And I reckon they've taken a bit of punch out of the bike as well. But hey, I'm not sure whether that's because they're quieter or not. The quietness thing is not me, but it's probably a good thing for all the neighbours when I leave early in the morning or come home late at night. My mate behind me says he can actually hear the stereo on his street glide now. I'm sorry guys, but I've lost audio on the GoPro. Friggin' typical, the GoPro media adapter is two years old and shits itself. Everything on GoPro shits itself just after the warranty period's expired. Typical made in China crap. No audio for the rest of the trip. Again, sorry. That's the Kanchanaburi War Cemetery on the left. 6,983 Allied POWs are buried there that died during the Second World War, building the death row at the hands of the Japs. Mainly Aussies, Brits and the Dutch will be at our hotel shortly. Seven thirty a.m. Staying at Sky Resort. Um, it's about seven hundred odd bar to nine, including breakfast, uh, which to my Aussie friends is thirty bucks thereabouts, thirty thirty five bucks. Have a think about that on your ride, boys. Um, big room. Yeah, it's clean. It's tidy. It's fine. It's big. Pool's great. Huge pool outside, there's the bathroom. I'll uh, put the pool on for you. There's the pool over there, it's huge. Olivier's been up already then for a swim. You can probably see through there. Undercover park for all our bikes, so look after us here, because they know us. Happy days, we're going off for breakfast now. This is uh, the restaurant across the road, which includes the breakfast. This is the River Kwai. Did you get already? You can see up to the bridge up there. A couple of retro baits here, huh? having Mine's breakfast. A bowl back to my room and yeah. I'm in the morning. <laughs> Beautiful. One thing what is good for me is the coffee. They, they have just instant next cafe. No. Day two, heading on our northern loop from Kanchanaburi, 295 kilometres all up. Well, as already stated, my GoPro audio has shat, shat itself, so there's none of that. Compounding that, I'm currently in Hotel Quarantine in Australia, and cutting a long story short, I had a major computer, computer failure and lost a swag of files, mainly my video files. And therefore, I'm piecing this video together with limited files that I recovered. Apologies for that, but nothing I can do. I lost some really good stuff.
this is a Thai roadside diner. <laughs> Obviously, we just stopped for lunch after doing a very, very twisty, technical, fantastic um, section. Who would have thought? Yippee ki -yay. These were all taken at the top of the mountain from a nice lookout. A Thai sports car club rolled up at the same time. Day three, as usual, first thing we do in the morning is pack the bikes. We actually hate doing that bit, but anyway, path of course. We're all up early, even though we had, some of us had a pretty big night last night. Um, anyway, ready to rock and roll. Let's hope we can navigate ourselves over back over the top without going too far north of Bangkok. We're trying to always avoid Bangkok. Oh, we're back at CFM again. This time we're sitting in the coffee shop and we're allowing Morning. Olivia to go ape shit inside. So, this time it's Olivia that spent a swag of money, bought a set of ape hangers, trying them on for size. That's another one in the can, 1150 kilometres. This is one of our closest favourite rides. Please remember, folks, as I always say, life can be ever so short, therefore, live life today.